Good afternoon, everyone, and happy Valentine's Day. Let's take a look at your weather now forecast for the next 24 hours or so. Outside right now, you can see some of the snow from yesterday's storm. It's been a very blustery and cold day today, uh, but dry and sunny. So quick turnaround with much better conditions overall, but much colder out there compared to what we were seeing before the storm yesterday with much milder temperatures. Temperatures across the area right now in the low 30s and upper 20s already in some spots, 29 in Coventry. We will be cooling down significantly as we head towards the overnight with temperatures in the low 20s. But with the wind chills, it'll feel like uh, we're sitting right in the teens overnight tonight into the start of your day on Thursday. Satellite and radar, we're quiet and clear right now over pretty much all of southern New England. Uh, or Southern New England is quiet, but northern New England seeing... Uh, some light snow showers this afternoon and evening. The next system that we're tracking, though, already for Thursday night into uh, early Friday morning is a quick, what we call an Alberta Clipper system. So this will move through very quickly in a matter of maybe two, three hours, bring some light accumulations to our area. Uh, nothing compared to what we had yesterday, but could see up to two inches of snow uh, between that time frame of Thursday night and early Friday morning. And let's kind of take a look at more of the exact timing of that here. So overnight tonight, very cold but quiet. That's going to lead way to a cold start to your Thursday morning, right around 20 degrees, again, with those wind chills in the teens. As we head towards the afternoon, staying dry, we'll have some sunshine throughout the morning and early afternoon, but then those clouds start to increase ahead of this clipper system moving through Thursday night. And then by around 10, 11 o'clock, we're going to start to see this snow moving through, but again, these systems are generally very fast. Uh, not anything like a typical nor'easter that we saw yesterday. That takes a lot longer to move through. So already by around 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock in the morning, this will have already moved offshore and will be sunny and dry again uh, for the start of your day on Friday. So let's take a look at the rest of this evening here. If you have any date night plans tonight, it's going to be dry, quiet, and clear, but very cold out there with those temperatures in the 20s. So definitely want to bundle up if you're heading out for any evening plans. Your overnight forecast, again, will be seeing those lows right around 20 degrees. It's going to be clear, but gusty with those wind chills in the teens. And this will lead way to a cold start to your Thursday morning as you're heading to work with those temperatures still right around 20 degrees. We'll warm up uh, to about the upper 30s by the afternoon. So seasonable, but still pretty chilly out there with those clouds beginning to increase as we head towards the evening ahead of this overnight system that we're tracking for Thursday night into Friday morning. So keep checking at, back in with us for updates on that system on Thursday night. But again, not looking at any major impacts from this, but could see a couple of inches of snow as this pushes through late Thursday night. And as always, you can get your full forecast anytime at WPRI.com.